Hey there folks, Aldershot here. We're back with some more Long Dark. And uh, before I started recording, I did a few bits of organizing and uh, weight management and all that kind of good stuff. And let me show you what I got going here. So let's go into our uh, consumable locker here. As you can see, I've collected a lot of water. <laughs> like a lot of water. We have 8.5 kilograms. Uh, of water, which is about six or seven liters uh, in storage. So we're not going thirsty anytime soon. Uh, I've also took some advice from you guys, from the viewers, and I put away as much stuff that we're not using as possible. So I'm just carrying basically the beer essentials as far as uh, food and consumables are concerned. So this is our consumable uh, inventory, this is just the food, let me show you our Medicare here. Uh, so as you can see, you know, beer essential, I'm only carrying one water purification tablet, uh, I do have a fair amount in the locker as well. Uh, bandages, just five of each kind of pill, I don't expect to get sick or to hurt myself too much today, hopefully, anyways. So we're just going to carry five each. It's not going to weigh us down too much. You know what? We can probably break it down to even just three each. So let's do that. Uh, yeah, three there. And let's put two away here. There we go. Even less weights. Even better. Uh, and let's see. What else here? What else? I'll show you our um, resources. I don't know what you call our tools and material locker, I guess. Uh, as you can see, I put away like a whole bunch of different stuff here. Let's switch to our tools. I even put away our sewing kits. You know, that's... You know what, I'm thinking about maybe just taking the sewing kit. Yeah, we're going to take the sewing kit. In case we find ourselves in a jam where we have to like hide in a random, you know, cottage or something like that. Uh, the sewing kit will be good to kind of waste some time so we can uh, maybe repair and rip up some excess clothing and all that kind of stuff, right? So, yeah, maybe I will take that with me. It's only 0.1 kilogram, so it's not too bad. Uh, let's see, what else do I put away? I put away a bunch of matches. I'm only carrying the beer essentials for matches. However, we do need more wood. We're really, really low on wood. Um, mostly reclaimed wood is what I'm looking for right now. So, we only have right now five hours of daylight left for this current session. So we will be spending some of that time in here, uh, breaking down some stuff to get some wood, because why not? We do have a hatchet, which is great, of course, and this will give us six pieces. That should really do us for the day, I think. You know, I, I, I'm not looking to hoard a whole bunch of wood here, and there's always, you know, there's always crates here to break down if we need to. Oh, a simple tool, might as well take that. Might as well. So, alright, um, we already explored pretty much everything in here, except for these leftover bits that I didn't pick up for some reason, but we'll definitely pick them up, why not, we're here. Uh, yeah, we've already explored this stuff here, we already took a look at all of this stuff here. Oh, crowbar! Man, we missed a lot of stuff. Or maybe I should just say I missed a lot of stuff. <laughs> I won't blame my incompetence on you guys. <laughs> Anyways, let's put this new fangled doodads uh, in the locker here. Uh, we're going to take our lowest condition pry bar. Use that up while we can. Seeing how I don't think you can repair pry bars, to be honest. We got a bunch of these hacksaws. I don't know, I don't know what we're going to use them for. We got a whole bunch of flares. We're going to keep two with us at a time. They're all at 100%, so we're pretty good on that. And we got six extra bullets in the storage, but we have eight bullets in the chamber, so we're good on that. We're going to put away all the tools, all the simple tools, because we're not going to use that on our journey out today. And we probably don't need to carry six pieces of reclaimed wood, so what we're going to do is... Oh, this container is full now, isn't it? Oh, my. Oh, my. Okay, well, we'll move on to the third one. This will also be our resource and material container as well. If it's going to be like that. Anyways, what was it going to put away? Right, sticks for storm lanterns. Um, we don't need the tool, which I think I already put away. Uh, right. 
all this wood. Let's put away three pieces. There we go. That should do it. We probably don't need all of this newspaper either. Let's just take one piece. Just as a, you know, uh, just in case kind of thing. And yeah, we're good. We're actually looking pretty good. We got six kilograms left to play with. Um, our stats looking okay, I think. We got how many hours? We got three hours of daylight left. I think that's enough hours to further explore the surrounding area as we never really explored a whole lot yet. So we'll take this opportunity now. There are a lot of wolves. One's coming at us right now. Boom! Screw you, hippie! Oh yeah, yeah, you better run away! <laughs> oh, I like that. That that wolf is smart. He's just like, screw this! I don't want none of this! Damn straight, you don't want none of this! Get out! Get out! <laughs> Anyways, we caught ourselves another wolf. That's uh, pretty good hunting. Pretty good hunting for, like, stepping out the door. <laughs> Alright, well, let's pick up some of these sticks, because we actually can use them. They're actually pretty useful. Um, let's harvest the wolf while the temperature is still pretty good. It feels like 2 degrees, so it's actually quite warm. This is actually a really good time to go exploring the last few hours of daylight, because uh, just like real life, the last few hours of daylight, or even the beginning of nighttime, uh, is the warmest because the sun has heated up the atmosphere and the earth and therefore it is the warmest time believe it or not you know a lot of people think it's the noon or maybe the morning because that's when the sun is brightest but you know the atmosphere and the earth never had time to warm up so it's actually at this period that is the warmest but it is getting a little bit colder now we got about two hours left of daylight but we are really close to our homestead so we're going to continue exploring. We got ourselves a wolf. We harvested him, which is nice. Uh, I don't know if I checked that car over there yet, so let's do that. Oh yeah, we definitely haven't checked it yet. So let's do that. Maybe we'll find some loot. Oh, painkillers are good. Heavy wool sweater. Uh, is that an upgrade? I'm not really sure. It might be. No, definitely not. We're already... Oh, wait, wait, wait. It is. It just needs repairing. We're only wearing a thin wool sweater. All right. We got something to do. Oh, God. Where is he? Where is he? There he is. Oh, shit. I missed. No, 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 no. Get. Get to... Get out of here. Ah! <laughs> That sucked. That really sucked. Alright, let's treat our wounds. Oh my. Oh my. Um, what's our health like? I can't find our health anymore. I just, they keep changing things and moving things around. Uh, our condition is 80%. Okay, we're still looking pretty then. Oh god, that wolf came back. For revenge, I guess. I shot his brother or something, or maybe sister. Oh, salty snacks, that's good. Some granola bars, that's pretty good. Time to look for shelter. Yeah, yeah, don't be a sissy, we're fine. Uh, how's our weight? We still got like 0.5 kilograms to play with, so that's pretty good. We're not encumbered quite yet. I thought we lost more health than 20% during that little uh, ruckus there, to be honest. But apparently not, which is a good thing, of course. It's a propane tank. Oh, some sticks. We can grab that. It's getting dark real quick. Real quick. Alright. Well, let's find some shelter in here. Because I don't think we've actually explored this building yet. Ooh, it's awfully dark. We definitely have not explored this building yet. There's, uh, I think, actually, maybe we have. I thought that was a code or something. Let's, um, let's bring out our lantern. We actually have a fair amount of fuel, so I'm not afraid to use up a little bit for the sake of this video. And for the sake of, obviously, you know, my sight. Okay, so we haven't explored it yet, because this cabinet is new. And there's a granola bar there, or a candy bar, so yeah. Definitely haven't explored it, because we would have 
absolutely picked it up. Uh, okay, nothing in there. Oh, maybe we have explored it. Look, we checked through all of this. It says empty. Okay, so we have explored it, and I was just un un unobservant and didn't pick those items up. All right, then. <laughs> uh, oh, while we're here, well, I guess we might as well pick this stuff up. Yeah, why not? Why not? While we're here, I mean, we, we're going to just drop it off to our homestead. We were definitely, definitely here. Can you tell, guys? <laughs> Look at all this junk that we left behind. So much junk. Let's see. Yeah, we took the water out of the toilet already. Hmm, nothing around anymore. Yeah, we've explored everything. And I'm pretty sure we're, like, super encumbered now. Well, not super encumbered, but encumbered enough. We got one hour of daylight left. Let's turn off our lantern or exit, whatever. LMB does everything. Alright, let's turn off our lantern. There we go. And see what else this area has to offer. Let's bring out our rifle just in case that damn wolf comes back. We wasted a damn bullet on him too, which is the worst. We definitely haven't explored that cabin, so... Let's go over there. We can probably take the night off in there as well. We got enough supplies with us uh, to last the nights without going back to the homestead. Um, however, however, if we do get in trouble, it's not far from our you know main supply line. So, yeah, I think it's a good idea to kind of spend the stay exploring this area here. Let's uh, bring out our lantern again. New location discovered. Okay, this is definitely new. Insulated boots. Grab that. Why not? Nothing in there. We are playing our stalker under stalker difficulty, keeping in mind. So, uh, loot will probably be scarce compared to uh, the lower difficulties, obviously. But we'll make the best of it anyways. Oh, cooked salmon. That's good. It's not a bad thing. We should probably check our stats, actually. We are getting a little bit parched, a little bit hungry. Uh, we're starting to get tired. Let's see. What are we going to eat? What's weighing us down the most? This thing. It's going to give us a, lo a lot of calories. We want to save that, actually. Let's eat this thing here. It's so weighing us down almost a full kilogram. It's only containing about 340 calories. So let's just eat that up. Uh, check on our stats. A bit peckish still, quite thirsty, so we're going to drink a soda. That should give us a little bit of nutrients, as well as a fair amount of thirst, just like that. And we're good! Alright! Let's keep, uh, let's keep looting. Oh, matches. Matches is good. And a little bit of tea. I rarely use the tea. I probably should start using it. I know some of you guys have mentioned previously in other episodes that, uh, if I actually start boiling tea and coffee, I would gain some... Passive buff benefits, like extra energy, um, extra hunger resistance, etc, etc. Which uh, I should probably start investing some time and in matches into, but... Oh well, <laughs> I never really do. Alright, let's get some sardines. I usually save the fire for cooking raw meat, right? I like investing into the beer essentials. You know, all that tea and coffee stuff that's that's basically as frills right as extra benefits if you have the resources to spare to get those extra benefits and I'm a stinge with my resources if you guys can't tell grab some of that grab some of this grab some of everything oh, some water some more water honestly you can never use too much water and I'm actually grateful that we have an abundance of water during this playthrough, to be completely honest. Because if you don't find it, it will use up a lot of your fire resources to gain. So we're going to take all the toilet water as well. Yummy yummy! Nothing like a little bit of uh, <laughs> toilet water, you know. <laughs> hey, if it's good enough for our, our dogs, it's good enough for us during a post-apocalyptic situation anyways. Uh, let's check our encumbrance. Very, very... <laughs> Very, very high. Oh my. Okay. Thin wool sweater. 
Our stats still looking pretty good. We're probably gonna spend a night here in this uh, very large, what looks like a queen size bed. Can we sleep on the bench? No, we can break it down though. Let's check the drawer. Nothing there. Nothing there. Oh, some gloves. That's pretty good. Nice photo. Nice family you got there. Too bad you're all probably dead. Sorry about that. Nope, nothing in there. Hey, over there. Oh my. Stalker difficulty. The difficulty that gives you a lot of basic gloves. It loves giving you gloves, apparently. Alright, well, it's uh, nighttime now. We have less than one hour of daylight. Let's spend a little bit of time exploring, not exploring, sorry, fixing our newly found heavy wool sweater. Repair. Uh, because this will definitely be an upgrade. Did it fail? I think it failed. Son of a bitch. Uh, let's try that again. Repair. Alright, very good. Now, what's the... Uh, still a downgrade. Uh, still need some more repairing. So, let's keep repairing. Repair. Failed! My god. Apparently, we're not a very good seams. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't harvest that. Oh god, I just used up all the friggin' lantern fuel. I should have turned it off. What was I thinking? I should have turned it off while repairing. Oh my god, I'm an... I'm an idiot. <laughs> I would just say, I'm an idiot. This is how you not play the long dark, guys. When you're, <laughs> when you're, when you're repairing your stuff, turn off your lantern. You don't, you don't need it on. You, you just don't. <sighs> derpy Aldershot is derpy. I'm sorry about that, guys. I'm just an idiot sometimes. Anyways. <laughs> anyways, let's keep repairing our damn... <laughs> Our damn uh, heavy wool sweater. I almost, almost actually harvested it, so. Oh, we're out of cloth. Uh, I guess we can make more. Let's just check our stats first. Yeah, we can, we can afford the time. Um, let's break down this basic glove here. Action. Harvest. This time we actually do want to harvest it. Very good. Now we can probably repair this. Yes, we can. It'll take an hour. That's fine. Okay, back. Ah, uh, it's a slight upgrade. It's definitely an upgrade for the warmth bonus. Good enough. Let's wear it. Good enough. It's only like a 0 0.1 degree Celsius downgrade from the wind chill bonus. So it's definitely worth it. Definitely, definitely worth it. Anyways, um... It is that time of the night. We should probably go to bed. Uh, we're feeling a bit pe peckish. Uh, pretty thirsty. Do we have a soda with us? Well, we have many sodas. Alright, let's drink a soda. Actually, you know what? I kind of want to eat... Yeah, I kind of want to eat some of this food here. Because they're weighing us down a lot. And we, it's not like we can't use the calories. And, okay, good, good, good. Uh, we're still really thirsty. So we'll drink some water. We got lots and lots of water. Not afraid to use up some of that. Very good stuff. Excellent, excellent. Uh, it's really, really dark now. I don't have a lantern with fuel in it anymore, so... You know, deal with it, <laughs> essentially. We're going to drop some of this stuff here so it can cure while we sleep. Um, we're also going to drop some of this fresh meat as well, so they don't degrade in our pockets while we're sleeping as well. And I should do it. Technically, I should drop all this stuff. I'm really lazy. I don't care about a couple percentage degra degradation. I'm too lazy to pick it all up. So we're, <laughs> we're going to just go to sleep with all the stuff in our pockets. Whatever, right? Uh, all right. Well, it's dark. It's not going to make a very good video. So let's just go to bed out of it. I can't see Jack all. Where's the bed? Where's the damn bed? Where's the damn bed? Oh, God. All right. I'll use a damn match. How do I use a damn match? Which 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 key is it? All right, here we go. 
What, what, what the hell are we looking at? Oh, we were looking at the ceiling the whole time. Okay. <laughs> Alright, let's, uh, let's go to bed out of this. Uh, let's sleep for, say, seven hours. I think that'll do us. I think that should do us. All right, 13 hours of daylight left, and we're at 100% condition, uh, getting a little thirsty, we can probably take a little drink here, probably just a soda, because we can use a little bit of calories as well, so we'll drink our lowest condition soda, of course, all right, we should be looking real good now, yeah, we should be, we're pretty good now, all right, folks, I think I'm going to end the let's play here, uh, pretty productive, episode i gotta say we got a whole bunch of stuff we went back to an old uh cottage that we didn't fully explore and grab some of the stuff there we got to this cottage here which we did fully explore uh ran out of lantern fuel because i'm a moron <laughs> don't don't do that if you're repairing stuff or doing anything for the long term turn off your lantern you don't need it on uh and let's see we killed ourselves a wolf and harvested the resources out of um, that bitch. I <laughs> get it? Female dog? Never mind. Don't worry about it. <laughs> and, um, we got bitten by another bitch. <laughs> but, uh, she ran off, or he ran off. I don't know. I never checked between its legs. Uh, but either way, pretty productive day overall, I gotta say. Yeah, definitely, definitely a good day. Uh, anyways, I'm gonna end the let's play here. I still have to gather up some of the stuff that I dropped here, but, uh... Yeah, we're going to head back to our homestead in the next episode. Or actually, I'll probably do that before filming the next episode. As not to bore you with uh, resource management and all that stuff. And uh, we'll continue exploring around the gas station. I think we've actually explored most of it, if not all of it already. So we'll probably explore more of the coastal highway overall in the next episode. We'll probably actually head out and start doing some actual exploration so anyways folks i'm gonna end it here thank you so much for watching as usual i do appreciate it um and uh yeah hopefully you folks have a merry christmas and happy new year guys happy new year happy 2016 may it be even better than your 2015 uh if you enjoy this you know like share fave and comments show me some love and all that stuff if you haven't already subscribe i'll bring you lots more long dark videos as well as lots of other video games as well Thank you for watching, everyone. All the shoutouts.